This is the last time you'll see Nolly with this long hair. I mean, what's happening here? She's going to get it all cut today, aren't you? And she's going to get these cut. I mean, look at those. Can't wait. Hopefully you're a good girl with the other dogs, huh? Are you gonna be a good girl? Are you gonna get along with the other dogs? Good morning, it's day four. I've just absolutely loved this so far. I've loved Vlogist. It's been so fun to watch you guys and to just connect with you guys in the comments and stuff. It's just been a lot of fun. I love this filming every day, so it's awesome. But this morning, we are off to take Nala to get groomed. She's getting a little haircut, she's getting her nails filed down, and she's also getting her undercoat taken off so she won't shed as much for a while, which is gonna be awesome. So I can't wait for that. She's probably gonna look really different. Last time we did this, she looked so different. So that's gonna be a lot of fun, and then, after that, we're probably gonna study for a good two hours. Actually, we're probably gonna study while she's getting her hair cut. We're probably, he's probably gonna go to Starbucks. I'm gonna stay at the house and just study for a little while. And then we're going grocery shopping together. I talked him into coming with me, so that's awesome. So we're gonna go do that. That'll, that always takes about an hour because we have to go to two or three stores, you know? And then after that, my parents are coming over and my sister because my dad's taking my mom and Casey to the airport tonight because they're going to Vegas for, I think I told you guys about this before. I ended up not, I opted out of the trip just because I have a lot going on. I just can't go right now but they're going to Vegas tonight for a couple of days, so that will be awesome. But wh whatever we do today, I will take you with us. You'll get to see my family, so it's a good day. Today's diffuser combo, peppermint, lavender, and lemon, the best combo ever. It's probably my favorite ever. So I've just been studying, and I'm just waiting for Alex to get home with Nala. He said that they actually didn't we didn't schedule her for a haircut, we just did the shedless program. So she didn't get a haircut this time. So she probably won't even look that different, but hopefully it'll help with all of her shedding. Little Nolly! You look so beautiful! You look so beautiful, baby! How do you feel? How do you feel? How do you feel? Were you a good girl? Hey. Can you say hello to the vlog? No? Say my mullet is still here, so we gotta schedule an appointment for a haircut because mommy and daddy didn't do that on accident. We just scheduled it for the shedless program, but that's okay. She smells so good. Don't you smell good? She keeps sniffing herself, it's so funny. So we've been cleaning a little bit today in the whole house and it feels good, but I have crap all over me. Not cool. But now I think we're gonna go run some errands. We're going to get coffee, and I can't even look at the camera because the sun is too bright. This is crazy. How hot is it out here today? 1,004 degrees. Way too hot. Way, way too hot. So we're at Starbucks now. Alex is running in, as you can tell. <laughs> but, and look, you can see the little stick in here. Awesome. But I don't know about you guys. I know it's the time of year right now for all of like this road work and road construction and everything, but... I can't even explain to you guys how bad it is around here. Like, you can't get anywhere without there being some type of detour, and it just sucks. Like, it's crazy right now. So, I'm as much as I really love summer, I kind of hope that this all ends soon because it's crazy. But then you see like p stupid drivers like driving past these construction workers going so fast and I'm like can you just slow down like I get it like yeah it's frustrating but they're trying to just make it better and two like don't put them in danger you know I don't know just a crazy thing I don't even know why I'm ranting about this but it really has been an issue around here lately and it does suck but it's like it is what it is so we just have to deal with it and I just hate when I see drivers you know acting like idiots and you know possibly putting these people into danger look what's here my face so I wanted to show you guys what I got in that Ulta box today. It's pretty much all hair stuff, but the first thing I got that I'm probably the most excited about is this Tarte Lip Exfoliant. And I've seen this actually a lot online, but basically it's just a lip exfoliator. I can't open it with one hand, so. But uh, it's supposed to be really, really good, and I really need it. My lips have been struggling lately, so I'm excited to try this. I'll let you guys know how it is. And then I got this Shea Moisture uh, Strengthen, Grow, and Restore Conditioner. I've been using this all the time lately, and they had a buy one, get one for half off at Ulta, so I decided to restock. 
I love this stuff. It's the only thing I've been using lately, like conditioner wise in my hair, along with my Young Living conditioner. I mix them together, but I swear you guys, my hair has grown so much since I started using this last month and I just love it. And then this is the hairspray that I've been using. It's just the Matrix Volume Fixer and I feel like it really does give a lot of volume. I actually put a little bit in my hair when it's still wet and then I just let it dry overnight. I also use this in my hair when I first get out of the shower. This is called Curl Please. It was called something else before but it's still, it's a, it's a Matrix product, total results, and it's just the contouring curl lotion and I really like that. And then this I haven't used before but I have used the Mega Sleek uh, line before but this is basically for when I want to do my hair straight it's just a matrix product again the total results and it's called blow down uh, it's a smoothing leave-in cream so I'm gonna use that when I straighten my hair but yeah those are the items that I got I believe they were these were buy two get one free and then this was buy one get one half off and then this was just full price but I think it's gonna be worth it I got the exfoliator open it seriously smells like peppermint. Like I'm really excited. This is what it looks like. I don't know if you can see like the little, I don't know if it's sugar in there or what they use as the exfoliators, but it smells awesome. I'm sure it's gonna be great. Okay, I've got it on. It's what it looks like. It feels like pepperminty on my lips. I really like it. I hope it gets that weird layer that I've had on there for like two days. I really like this. I actually use a Lush lip exfoliator too, but this one seems awesome. This lighting is just terrible. Okay, before the lighting changes back to red again, I wanted to tell you guys about my glasses because I always get questions about my glasses like all the time, but all of my glasses for the most part are from Zenny Optical. I'll link it down below for you guys, but these glasses specifically, they're uh, prescri prescription lenses and the entire pair was like 30 bucks for prescriptions. So you can't beat it. I think they start as low as seven bucks for prescription glasses. Uh, they have all different ranges of things. If you have like really bad eyesight, of course it'll be a little bit more expensive for the prescription, but even then, I wouldn't say that there's many that are over like 70 or $80, so you can't beat it. So I, you guys, I've talked about this so many times, but you guys know I have like 20 pair of glasses and I kind of have an issue with it, like I, buy way too many glasses but I like things to you know match things I like these for the fall time so I'm like I'm like channeling fall right now I want fall so bad so I have my brown on but you can't tell because it's like red lighting what is happening I'm sad because my family just left and I forgot to film them I was doing my sister's makeup my mom took a shower it was like a really quick situation and I <laughs> I didn't get to film them what are you doing staring at us I do love that pick though, so cute. You ready to go to the store? Let's do this. So my mom and sister left their cars here for the weekend and we are gonna take my sister's Renegade because hello, how beautiful is that? First stop, Aldi. Then we're going to Meyer after that. They have so many different special buys. Alex is checking them all out. I love this aisle. This is my favorite aisle. <laughs> Of course he's looking at the vanilla wafers. Lots of stuff. Strawberry lemonade. This is definitely my favorite aisle though. I really want to get these, but we have like a pretty big bag from Costco at home that we haven't eaten yet. So I'm not going to, because these are three bucks for a little bag. Ew. I can't, I don't like baby corn. It freaks me out. <laughs> what are these? These are the things Heidi likes, right? Heidi Powell. They have these at Costco, but these are the Aldi brand. They look yummy. We got down, we went to Meyer and Aldi, and this is what we got. I'm not gonna do a haul in this video, but maybe in another video, but we got lots of good stuff. Here we go, getting ready to watch the live Big Brother tonight. I don't know who's going home, but I'm gonna think that it's Dave Vaughn, but we'll see. Dave Vaughn or Bridget's out the door. We love Big Brother so much, that's all I'm saying. If you're watching, leave a comment down below and let us know how much you love Big Brother too. So I'm just laying in bed and I'm getting ready to watch the My Big Fat Fabulous Life finale. I believe it's the finale. It's from a couple days ago, I think. But I'm just laying here with my little baby girl and I'm gonna watch this, probably edit this vlog a little bit and then go to bed. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Mm -hmm.